Anthropogenic noise has become a pervasive, uncontrolled and global pollutant that has modified the natural acoustic environment. This noise can mask or even inhibit the formation of animal sounds and has been shown to negatively affect acoustic communication, reproductive success and foraging behaviour. Surprisingly, there hasn't been a lot of work done on gastropods, likely because they do not communicate using sound, though they have been shown to respond positively to music in a manner that signals enhanced learning ability. Therefore, I set out to investigate the effect of low frequency and high frequency sounds on the foraging behavior of the giant African land snail. Five snails of varying sizes were collected from pavements with moderate human traffic. Each of these snails were individually placed on top of cell by tie leaves, and once they started eating, a speaker 10 cm above them would play a low frequency sound of 20 Hz for 5 minutes. They then took a break of 30 minutes before being exposed to a high frequency sound of 20,000 Hz for another 5 minutes. Their behavior during their exposure to sound was observed. Four out of five snails continued to eat, and eat, and eat, regardless of whether they were exposed to the low or high frequency sound. There was also one curious adventurer that moved in the direction of the speaker instead of munching on the leaves. Overall, none of the snails displayed any form of defensive behavior, such as retreating into their shell. Even though snails do not have any form of auditory features such as ears to detect sound, they are sensitive to vibrations. Since low frequency noise is very prevalent in the environment, it is likely that the snails are more habituated to the vibrations generated from these sounds, thus showing no reaction when exposed to it. This lack of response towards low frequency sounds was within expectations. However, it was surprising that there was no reaction when exposed to high frequency sounds. This could be attributed to the highly tolerant and adaptable nature of these snails. As an invasive species, being less sensitive to changes in the acoustic environment could aid their spread and establishment in a novel habitat. This finding provides evidence that invasive species could be less sensitive towards anthropogenic noise pollution and requires further investigation into other known invasive species from other phyla.